All right, so I just got back. I'm really hungover from Nikki's birthday party last night at the Saddle Ranch. We didn't film any of it, but we had just a really, really good time hanging out with our friends, Caitlin, Bonnie, Dave, um, and two guys from Canada named uh, Kevin and Kyle, who actually worked for Gaming 2.0 when we went out. But there's a huge fire outside our house. Check that out. So this will be the start of our vacation vlog. Um, we're going up to, for the weekend, we're going up to Lake Arrowhead. And it's, uh, it's kind of interesting. I heard all these fire trucks going by, all these sirens. I was like, what the hell? And finally, like the fire truck, I heard it go right by. And he honked at somebody. And uh, I looked out the window, and there's a fire over there. That's where all the little hoodlums go over to smoke and drink. Uh, kind of like right up there. So it's on fire. It looks like they're doing a pretty good job of getting it out. The smoke's starting to go down. When I looked out here like five minutes ago, there was smoke everywhere. Um, but they're taking care of it now, so that's kind of exciting. And we're going to Lake Arrowhead. We're headed up to the mountains. The road's all twisty and turny. Uh oh, here comes another one. Ah! Like, and these people are going way faster than I am. Ah! <laughs> anyway, we're headed up to Lake Arrowhead for my birthday. I'm really, really excited. I look like crap today because oh, my my actual time. yeah my actual birthday was yesterday and so we went out around Hollywood and we went out to the Saddle Ranch last night and I got hammied. We didn't and go to bed until 7 a.m. We did not go to bed until 7 a.m. Can you believe that? It's been a long time since I've done that but I had a lot of fun. Um, I'm just a little bit out of it today. But John rented a cabin up on Lake Arrowhead for my birthday, so um, we're going to spend the weekend up there, which should be pretty cool. Um, my friend April and her boyfriend Michael are coming up tonight, and then we have a few more friends that are going to come up tomorrow. So it should be a lot of fun. We had to pull over because Kenobi's being annoying. Oh, there he goes. He does have to poop. John was right. And this is what it looks like driving up a mountain. Get up there, there are rocks There's everywhere a, because mountains are made out of rocks. There's actually a rock slide up here that's pretty neat. <laughs> Fell on the road again. Whee! Whee! Ow! <laughs> My seatbelt hit me in the throat. Uh -huh. So this is something that we've been talking about doing for like pretty much since we moved to California. And the first time that we ever came up in this area, we were like, oh, it would be so cool to rent a cabin up here and like have our friends up. And now we're like actually doing it. So it's like, I don't know. It's really interesting to me. It's like something we were talking about for a long time and now we're like actually doing it. Know, we're, we're growing like, up. We're kind of growing up, getting old and going on vacations together, but yeah. But here's where we're actually staying. It's like a little community um, of cabins and cottages. So that's pretty neat. Um, we kind of really like the place we're staying in. It's really, it's like, it seems pretty small and it's pretty crammed in. Um, but uh, we're, we think we're just gonna have an amazing time this weekend. We think it's gonna be pretty awesome. We're just really excited to be up here. Uh, I gotta walk, just got done walking Kenobi. Gotta walk Thor, and then Lola, and then I'm gonna go get some lunch and try to wake some people up. Right now we are in, where are we? What is this city called? Running Springs and we're hiking down this trail to like kind of a secretive spot where they have swimming holes and hot springs so I'm pretty excited about that. Uh, we got my girl April with us and her boyfriend Michael and John of course. Whoa! That's weird. <laughs> uh, this is quite the hike. I'm wearing flip-flops. I, I need like hiking boots for this. He said there's lots of rattlesnakes and we gotta watch out for those. Ah, I hope I don't get bit. That would suck. Happy birthday, Nikki, from nature. You're gonna die. Pretty. I like the mountains. The California mountains. This is actually, this is such a great birthday present. Thank you so much, John, for bringing me up here and inviting my friends. <laughs> But this is like this is like the perfect birthday getaway for me. Just chilling in the California mountains, in nature, back to where I belong. I belong in nature, in the wilderness. Wow. I thought you were like referring to like an animal or something. I thought it. <laughs> oh, you got a walking stick. 
I thought there was like a snake. I thought you said snake. It's cool we were told about this place. It's like in the middle of nowhere. I guess we got like a, a secret tip from a local. I don't think we would have found it otherwise. For the cost of $10. Yep, we gave a guy <laughs> 10 bucks and he showed us where this place is. <laughs> what do you mean, like LARPing? Live action role play? <laughs> John, ha John and Michael have their big sticks and now they want to LARP. <laughs> I'm down. I'm down. I'll LARP with you guys. Tra la 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 la. I am the fairy queen. But I can also beat people up. Dive. I think it's deep enough. Should just dive right on in. Whoa. We found more water. This is cool. But where do we swim? That is the question. Pretty, I've never seen a wild iris before. Earlier, everyone was talking about how this seems like a plot to a horror movie or the start of a horror movie. And now I, I totally can see it. <laughs> no, none of us have any idea where we're going. We're just kind of wandering aimlessly. We didn't really pay attention to the directions that guy gave us. We are still lost. John thinks he knows where he's going, but he has no idea where he's going. I said, that's a dead end. And he goes, it's not a dead end. It's just a unkept path. A beaten path. A beaten path. Yeah. Ah, over From the log. Ask the people on YouTube, does this look like a path that's been well-traveled? Yes, it does. It looks like Ooh. sand. So hot shot. Tell me about this path that's traveled by people all the time that we're on right now. <laughs> yeah, we found water. yeah, well, we can hear the water over there. You're the one to turn the camera on, so now I have to keep going. By definition of man law. Okay. Yeah, that's the highlight of John's trip. He yeah. goes, we got to, at least we got to find this piece of wood. He thinks that piece of wood is so beautiful. Haha, <laughs> wood. Well, this creek goes up, and like, this is all stuff that's been brought down by the river when it was high water and all the snow was melting and left here. So it goes up and down, but I don't we know. We will find it. We will find it. Or maybe the local that gave us this tip just hates tourists. So he like, this place just doesn't exist at all and he just sent us on a wild goose chase so we get lost and die. No, he likes money. He wants our money. <laughs> Moss grows on the north side of a tree. What? That's what they said on Hey Arnold. I'm not trying to complain though. I'm not trying to, you know, be whiny or anything because this is actually kind of fun. It's just like, I'm starting to get a little nervous, you know? Okay, the girls have taken their shirts off. <laughs> have to do something. <laughs> We've been wandering so long, we decided to take our shirts off because we at least want to get a tan since we're out in the they sun. Power out here. <laughs> That's gonna break, John. Not a smart idea. <laughs> wow. Okay, it didn't break. Now we're headed back the way we came. Uh, it's like a little adventure, adventure time with Nikki and John. Um, we think we should have taken a left at Albuquerque. So we're going back to see if really? we can gotta, find it the other way. Get a twist the knife? Just a little twist too? <laughs> yeah. So that was a fail. <laughs> we ended up just walking back to the car. Um, we didn't find the swimming hole, so now we're gonna drive to another lake that isn't too far from here that's actually on a map. That was our hiking trip. We went hiking in the mountains today. People do that. That's a touristy thing right to do. There. So today was our hike. <laughs> it was fun. We saw some cool stuff in there. It was pretty. Woo, here we are. Isn't that a pretty lake? A little, little secluded place. We're the only ones here at the beach today. We have to lay by the swings because the rest is all shady. Good thing there's no kids around. Yeah, we ended up going back to Lake Arrowhead and we just got a beach pass from our hotel. We didn't know that we could do that. <laughs> we thought all the beaches were private here. I love to lay out, but the sun is almost disappearing. Ah, we'll have to come back to the beach tomorrow and come earlier. How cute is that? We have a mama duck with her four little baby ducklings. Is that a nest? Is she sitting on them? She's sitting on the ducks for all the babies. Oh, hello. <laughs> I'm just trying to make her feel comfortable. Aww. That's so cute. Zoom in more. Babies! It's dinner time! <laughs> so we're gonna go. 
I'm gonna, you have to keep walking or I'm gonna crash into you, John. <laughs> no, I crashed. Um, we're gonna go get some birthday dinner in me. I'm gonna get something good to eat. Um, so we're taking a walk around Lake Arrowhead Village and see what tickles our fancy. That's what April said we should do. See whatever tickles our fancy <laughs> and then dine there. They have like a festival going on. Look, Lollipop Park. I feel like we're in Candyland or something, some magical village. Something. They have bumper cars, go karts. Oh, they do. Golf. I don't know. Cool. They have like bumper cars down there. That'd be fun. Let's try it. Here's a bunch of wooden boats. They have a wooden boat festival tomorrow. There's the boat that there's a boat out there that the kind that uh, John F. Kennedy had. I forgot what they're called, but they're like really famous wooden boats, and they're like $160,000. That's neat. Oh, I suppose we could actually go on the dock. So this is these are what wooden boats look like. <laughs> I should, John should be the one talking because I have no idea what to say about them. Yeah, don't hit a rock with them. Don't they're hit They're really, a rock with they're them. antique. They're really expensive. They're really hard to maintain. It's kind of like it's like having like a high-end sports car, basically. I like this one. This one looks dangerous. Like a bad guy in a movie would be riding this one. Meet me. I just kind of realized that when I'm filming, I don't really pay attention to whatever else I'm doing. And how funny would it be if I just walked off the dock, like was vlogging and just fell off into the water. Look who just showed up me. to dinner. <laughs> Not you. We got Alpha Cat and Nate's vlogs in the house. We decided to eat at a place called Woody's Boathouse. Yay! Birthday dinner commenced. <laughs> Thor's growling in the background. April's tickling him. Anyway, we made it back to the cabin after... <laughs> we made it back to the cabin after eating and we are so full. Oh my gosh, we filled up so quickly. Oh my gosh, <laughs> April and I were sitting there at dinner and I turned to April and I go, Hey, April, um, I kind of want to unbutton my pants. <laughs> I don't know if that's really trashy or not. And she's like, I do it all the time. And like April and I both unbuttoned our pants and we we're like sitting there at the table like, oh, like after a big Thanksgiving meal. Um, we're going to go out to the bars, uh, try to have a little bit of fun. Birthday fun. Woo woo. Uh, there's karaoke here. I keep saying that. Your it's her birthday. It's like on Wednesday. Yeah, but you get to This is my birthday, birthday trip. Yeah. yeah, it's my birthday weekend. You brought me here for my birthday. So I, I gotta celebrate still, right? <laughs> but there's karaoke at this bar that's um, in the uh, like hotel thing. Not hotel, what is it? What is it called? Lodge. If they have a lar In the oh, lodge, yeah. It is, it could, like the hotel. Okay, but it's like it's but they're cabins, so I don't know if it would be called a hotel. Anyway, yeah, there's karaoke, so that should be interesting. Nate's a huge karaoke freak, yeah. so um, we're gonna go check that out, and then I don't know, maybe hit up a few places around town. When I toasted you, said, "Honey, we may be through, but you'll never hear me complain, cause I got friends in low." This is where the whiskey drowns and the beer chases my blue rain. And I will be born and raised in South Detroit. I took the midnight train going anywhere. Swing to the roads. We had a ton of fun going out and hitting up Lake Arrowhead. Uh, we made some new friends. This is a great little city, a little town. Um, the people are so nice and we just had a blast. But I'm pretty tired. It's time to go to bed. Uh, and then I think we're going to try to do some more touristy things tomorrow, explore a little more. But I just wanted to let you guys know that I love you and stay tuned for more vlogs. Mwah.